Hey, Shelly Fair from Best Buy Canada's blog, and this past week I've been testing out the Tinco A10 Hero and the Tinco A11 Hero cordless stick vacuum cleaners. These both are budget-friendly vacuum cleaners, and I was actually very surprised at the amount of power that they both had. The Tinco A10 Hero has a 350 watt motor and a 105 watts of suction. It has a lithium ion rechargeable battery and as you can see there's a rechargeable battery light right on the vacuum and it has several attachments that you can use to clean your floor. This is the mini brush that I'm using to clean the floor but the most frequent brush that you'd probably use is the high torque multi-purpose brush. While it has a powerful motor, it also has a, a very quiet running motor. And one of my favorite features on this vacuum cleaner is the continuous switch. So as you can see, you can just pull that switch there and then you can let go and you will have continuous cleaning. You don't have to keep on holding the switch. It just sticks on there and the vacuum cleaner keeps running until you remove. This vacuum has a built-in four-stage HEPA filter, so it collects allergens as it cleans your home. And the high-torque brush has a light, so you can always see what's in front of you when you're cleaning. This is the Tinco A11 Hero. This vacuum cleaner is also a cordless stick vacuum cleaner with a rechargeable lithium ion battery. Slightly more powerful than the A10, it has a 450 watt motor with a 120 watts of suction. Both vacuums, the A10 and the A11, come with the high torque power head with lights. It's a great power head. It's probably one of my favorite power heads that I've ever tried on a vacuum cleaner. I really appreciate the lights, especially when you're cleaning in dark corners because you don't miss anything. You just, you can go right up to the side of the cupboard, see what's there and make sure that you pick it up. Cordless stick vacuum has a slightly larger dust bin and it has a slightly longer battery life. On max power, you should be able to continuously clean for approximately 40 minutes. But there are three variable speeds on this vacuum cleaner and you can switch between them by clicking the button, uh, one of the buttons on the top of the vacuum right there. Um, but if you leave it in low mode, you still get a decent amount of suction um, and an increased battery life. But if you put it to max mode, you will have a quicker drain of battery. I managed to get, I was switching between modes and I managed to get about 28 minutes of suction from the vacuum cleaner before the battery was dead. Both the A10 and the A11 come with a docking station and the battery will thread through into the docking station so you can just pop it into the docking station and it will start charging. The docking station also holds all of your accessories. So it will hold everything that the Tinco A10 and the Tinco A11 come with. Both vacuum cleaners were easily able to handle the low pile carpets and the high pile carpets. It didn't struggle with them. They were able to pick up a lot of dirt and debris. Um, the, just the difference between the two is the size of the dustbin. So the Tinco A10 has a 0.4 liter dustbin and the Tinco A11 has a 0.6. Both vacuum cleaners are also able to easily transition into a handheld vacuum cleaner. So here's a look at the Tinco A11 cleaning my couch. You just pop the high torque power brush onto the front of it. It becomes a handheld furniture cleaner or a cleaner for your car. If I had to choose between the A10 Hero and the A11 Hero, I think I would choose the A11 Hero just because it comes with a little bit more power. Although I don't think that the power difference was all that noticeable when I was cleaning. The Tinco A11 also has a extended battery life in comparison to the Tinco A10, where the Tinco A10 will last about 25 minutes and the Tinco A11 will last up to 40 minutes. That's it for my look at the Tinco A10 Hero and the Tinco A11 Hero cordless stick vacuum cleaners. You can see my full written review on Best Buy Canada's blog. Thanks for watching.